this is going to be a complete 5-bit web 3 wallet tutorial and we will see everything about it. Everything about it. From creating the wallet to sending crypto, receiving crypto and staking crypto. Everything about crypto and this wallet. So let's get started with it already. But make sure to create your account on Bybit and verify it. Now here on the top left, you get to see this option of web3 simply click on it by the way you can also get the extension for your chrome and also the mobile wallet so for now we will create a wallet on our website itself click on create now a good amount of blockchain networks are now supported on bybit wallet so click on ok there will be no seed phrase given to you like other wallets as bybit stores your seed phrase itself now this is the screen that you will be seeing after clicking on ok and here you can see all the different networks deposits and withdrawals option as well and we can simply deposit crypto by just clicking on this option of deposit and not just your crypto tokens but you can also check out the nfts and DeFi on the one single platform itself let's explore it from the very top and here you can see your bybit cloud wallet in order to copy your address simply click over here and your address will be copied quite easily the balance is currently zero for obvious reasons as we have just created it and here you can see all the networks if you want to see any particular network in your bybit web3 wallet simply select that particular network and all the tokens or coins from that particular wallet will be seen over here along with their prices and the quantity that you hold and the value of that quantity that you hold now let's click on all networks for now and suppose you want to deposit ethereum in your wallet click on this option of deposit right next to ethereum and it is on ethereum network you can see a little ethereum logo right on the ethereum itself so this shows that the network is ethereum click on deposit and here you get the address that you can utilize in order to deposit ethereum on your web3 wallet of bybit now copy this address and paste it on any of the exchange out there in order to receive. Now let's take the example of Binance in order to do this particular transaction. So you would be able to understand it and do this transaction yourself. On Binance simply select spot wallet and open it up. Now here click on withdraw. Then select the coin and here since we want to withdraw Ethereum from Binance to Bybit Web3 wallet we will select the Ethereum and then it will ask us to provide the address. We will just simply paste the address that we just copied and select the network. Network is Ethereum and you can see it yourself that network is Ethereum for the Ethereum coin. And here we can simply type the amount of Ethereum that we want to withdraw and after verification on Binance we can withdraw this particular Ethereum that we want to withdraw. This is how easy it is to withdraw and you can follow the same procedure on any other wallet or exchange as well in order to get the funds or any crypto in your web3 wallet of bybit now let's see how we can withdraw the crypto from bybit web3 wallet to any other exchange out there and we will be taking binance as the example in this video you can follow the same process in order to withdraw the crypto from bybit web3 wallet to any other exchange as well and wallet for that matter for this we will select the withdraw this time and suppose we want to withdraw the ethereum from here we will click on withdraw now here it will ask us to provide the address and the amount now for this we will simply open up binance and on binance click on this option then open up a spot wallet and this time instead of withdraw we will select the option of deposit now select deposit crypto and here it will ask us to select the coin we will simply type ethereum or select the ethereum from here and in the network we will select ethereum since it is a ethereum network and we will get the address copy this particular address and open up bybit web3 wallet and paste the address over here then type the amount and guess we will be charged from your balance and after that you can simply send this particular ethereum quite easily from bybit wallet to your binance account or any other exchange and this is how easy it is to withdraw the crypto now let's see how you can participate in crypto airdrops using this wallet for this you will be able to find this option of earn at the top and here you can see the option of 
airdrop arcade simply open it up here you can check out all your rewards and when we scroll down further we can see the featured airdrops as well you just have to click on this option of any particular airdrop and check the details about that particular airdrop and here when we scroll down we can see different tasks available to us we just have to complete these tasks in order to earn the rewards and on the basis of these points you will be given out some airdrop and there are different kinds of airdrops as we saw over here and each one has a different task that you need to complete and on the airdrop or in some cases you will get a chance to get the airdrop when we scroll further you can see the daily rewards as well you can click on these rewards in order to earn them and check them out and their details as well each and every activity over here has a task associated with it that you need to complete in order to earn these airdrops. Now let's explore the section of IDOs which is initial DEX offering before the tokens getting listed on big centralized exchanges or some other places they usually list out some of their tokens to decentralized exchanges and this is the place where some of the tokens get listed even before getting listed on the centralized exchanges. So there is a possibility of making huge gains if it is played out quite well then you can make uh, 16 to 17 times of the money that you invested in the IDO and just research about it before doing or participating in it. Currently all the IDOs has ended on this particular section but the new ones will arrive whenever some new projects wants to collaborate with Bybit in order to offer this particular IDO. So you can check it out on regular basis or Bybit can also give you the notification of any particular new IDO. Now let's explore the part of staking where you can stake your crypto and earn some interest on it. For this, you will have to select the option of staking over here. When we scroll down over here, we can see different sections like the points, restake, single asset, multi asset. If you have got multiple assets, you can stake them all together in one go, but not every pair might be available for this particular one. You will just have to check them out and proceed with the process accordingly. You can see the rate of interest that you will be earning on that particular staking. So you can simply select any particular pair. Suppose you want to stake STX, simply click on it. Here just provide the amount of STX that you want to invest and after that you will be able to invest. You can also check out your current investments if you have already staked and also see your yield that you have earned till now. So this is how it will work and you can go with the other pairs as well if you want to. And in order to get the seed phrase wallet, simply click over here and then click on this option of download in order to download the seed phrase wallet and after that you would be able to participate in the uh, staking and all sort of other activities on Bybit Web3 wallet. Now let's see how we can purchase different crypto using DEX which is decentralized exchange. For this select the option of trade over here then click on DEX Pro and wait for it to load. Here on the left hand side panel you can see this particular option of search. You can search for any token using their name or address or you can see the list over here as well. You can select any particular network and all the coins related to that particular blockchain network will appear right below it. Then you can simply select it. These are mostly the Solana meme coins. You can purchase them as well if you want to. Simply select them and here you get the option to buy. Provide the option of the quantity that you want to purchase and amount of USDT can also be provided in order to check out the quantity that you will be able to purchase in that particular quantity. And then click on buy Popcat or any particular crypto. And this way you would be able to purchase the crypto on Bybit or trade it basically. In order to swap crypto from one to another, just select the option of trade then select the option of swap and here you can swap the crypto quite easily suppose i have usdt and i want to swap it to solana i will just simply select solana at the bottom and usdt at the top that i have already then type the amount that i want to utilize in order to convert it to solana then click on swap and you would be able to swap it quite easily you can also bridge your crypto from one network to another using this particular tool Suppose I have USDT which is on Solana and I want to convert it to Ethereum on Ethereum network not on Solana. So I will just simply click over here and select the option of Ethereum then select the option of Ethereum. We can also convert it to USDT on Ethereum network as well by selecting USDT on Ethereum network and this way 
you would just have to click on swap and this usdt which is on solana network will be converted to ethereum on ethereum network and you can bridge this usdt which is on solana to ethereum as well quite easily this is how you do it now let's see how we can buy and sell crypto on bybit wallet for this you will just have to click on this option of trade then select the option of crypto over here and after that select the buy option then over here on the currency and select the currency that you want to utilize in order to purchase the crypto then at the bottom select the crypto that you want to purchase which is usdt and using this usdt you would be able to purchase any other crypto out there as well and make sure that you select the network as well as network can make a huge difference you can see over here when you select the bnb chain the gas fees is 0.3 usdt but when you select the ethereum it gets to 5 usdt which is a big difference so make sure that you choose it quite wisely and click on next in order to purchase it in order to sell crypto simply select the option of sell then select the amount of usdt that you want to sell you can simply sell all your crypto to usdt or you can use the swap option that we just explored right now and after that you can convert all your crypto to usdt and then type the amount over here then select the currency of your country in order to receive the amount in that particular currency and make sure that you also select the network right and then click on next and follow the procedure and this way you would be able to sell the crypto and receive the amount in your bank account and this is how you do it there are still some features left to explore but this video is getting a little longer and keeping it shorter will help you absorb all the information told in this video itself and we can simply explore rest of the features in our next video if you want to you can just simply comment down below so i know exactly what it is that you are looking to explore if this video was helpful make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos